Hello everybody, I am Patches and welcome back to ARC. Now as you can notice, there are a few changes here. I did actually record an episode and unfortunately I lost the audio, so there is a bit missed but not a lot because I literally spent two hours taming this guy hovering in the air in front of us. He was level 25 and that was just how long it took him to eat all the food. And of course I happened to be taming him near crocodile territory. So that was fun, but we do have a extended pack of spitters. We have four now, and if I am correct, they're all male. Which is kind of ironic considering I couldn't find a male one for the life of me at the beginning of this series. And now all I'm finding are males, but we've got four male spitters now. We have finally got a saddle for one of our dinosaurs. He's kind of, or she actually is kind of slow, so I'm going to work on her speed. But we need to save up to be able to learn how to make the saddle for our new flying friend. Let alone the leather for it. So the first thing we're going to do now is we're going to go out. And we are going to work on, first off, getting some metal. Because we need more metal to be able to make more of the traps. I'm planning where is... Oh... You can go in there. You can go in there. Can I put you in there? Nope. So, first off, we're going to work out where I put my metal pickaxe. Because while it's not particularly handy for a lot of things, it is handy for collecting metal and we need more metal so we can make more of these to be able to, oh that is way bigger than I expected, to be able to catch some more large dinosaurs to get a lot of hide because we're going to need so much hide to be able to get to the next stage of things. So I am going to go top up my water and try to catch that spitter down there. And then we're going to see how much hide we can get from one of these long necks if we catch them in one of these traps. So first off, let's go catch this guy who's harassing the dodos. Don't you attack them. I want the spitter. Are you kidding? Don't kill it. I want it. Not dead. Oh well. Can't really do much about that. My aim is a bit bad at the moment, so we're gonna need to make some more of those. But to start off with, let's see how much hide we can get if we kill one of these big long necks. Now I've got one in mind particularly because if it's still there it was protecting an egg and well I kind of want to take the egg but if I take it while it's alive I'm going to be dead. So I don't know if the egg is still actually through here. Ugh not you. You little shit you stole something didn't you? That's it, run into the rock, I'll kill you. Alright, so there was an egg through here last time I tried to do a recording. It does actually look like it's disappeared. But either way, I... You all guys are going to be a mated pair, aren't you? I don't want a mated pair because then one of you is going to attack me while I try to kill the other. Are you or are you not? No, you're not a mated pair, so... Where'd my trap go? What happened to my trap? I didn't put it down. Oh yeah, and that's my chair I put down because I was going to try doing some fishing, but 
I don't know how to put bait on my fishing rods yet, so... I don't know how or where we've lost the trap. So I'm going to collect some metal and then we'll make another. How did you manage to glitch there? In the one spot where I can't take it. He probably stole my trap. That's what happened. And now I can't get to it because that is glitched in the air. Alright, let's see if I can break this down and get it back. Oh, ooh, I wonder if I can stop the crocodile with this. There we go. You did! You stole my trap, you little arsehole. Okay, so... Let's catch one of these guys with this trap and we'll kill it, basically. That's the goal. Alright, so this is the point where I probably want this over, say, a spear. So, three. This is probably going to end very badly. If you want to get to me, you got to walk into the trap. Come on. Walk into it. Come on, walk into the damn trap. you walk into that trap. Ow. Yeah, I'm about to die. That is not how you walk into a trap. Okay. Let's retry this, shall we? Nope, give me my bed. No, no one's in the trap. Maybe, can I re-pick it up? Yes. Alright, let's stick you more this way. There. Alright, so how many of my guys are actually alive? Alright, let's take everything. must have got caught in the trap because otherwise you wouldn't have had a go at me and the trap would still be there. Alright, so. There's got to be a better way to kill these guys. It doesn't involve getting all my dinosaurs killed. What else is in here? Why are you not following? So I got caught by the trap but didn't actually obviously take any damage from the trap. We need to set you to follow again. Distance. Follow. Guarding the corpse or anything, are you? So, in theory, given that we've only got one spitter following, there should be one more corpse to find. Hmm. 
Yeah, it's not over here or I would have... No, I didn't come this far. So, doesn't really work. Need a better way to pin these guys. Particularly don't target them when they're next to each other. Still need more metal for that, so... It looks like we might be going on a metal hunt. But where's my flying guy? He's still stuck down there. Let's get him over this way. And then we'll continue our search for hide and easier ways of getting it. Come on. Let's increase the weight because I do intend to ride you at some point. I want that. I want you to get away from there. Well, apparently you can't find in the fact that I'm behind him, so I guess he's gonna stay there for now. So let's get some metal and I'll see you guys after I've collected it. Alright, so we have one little trap. The question is, what gets caught by it? I might just leave it here and see what wanders into it because I don't want to start a fight with something that's not going to get caught by it. I just hope my dinosaurs don't walk into it. And I don't lose track of where it is. That would also be very unhelpful. Hmm. Well, for now, let's go for a walk on our big guy. I can certainly see this a lot easier that way. And let's see if we can find us some easy hide. You guys certainly aren't any. Ooh, there's a blue one coming down over there. The problem with the bear trap is it's only going to catch Sank for so long. And it's not going to be of use in that particular way. I presume anything, so long as nothing gets caught in it, it will stay there. Actually, I can pick it up, so I'm just going to go pick it up and we're going to go for a bit of an explore. A little guy's as close as he can get. Don't blame him after what's happened with the others. But you there will be an easy target. If I can throw far enough. Come on. 
Sorry, but I think I might get a fair amount of hide from you. My friend over there is still stuck in the wall. Come on. Let me on. Thank you. Alright, we're gonna go exploring down this way. There's something else that's easy to kill. Come on, stab it. Alright, you just float away from me. Let's see a couple things over there I can attack. But first, let's deal with these. There is no point for music for that, that is way too easy. You're an irritant and nothing more. Ooh. What have we got stuck over here? No, you give a bit of hide. So... Sorry, but... back to the sitting position. Very well. So, how much height have we got? We got 38 and we had about 15 back home. So that leaves us about 53? We need about 80 for the next saddle that we want, even after we've learnt it. So, we'll keep going for now and see Come on, if we can find enough hide, should be a nice, easy target. Really? That didn't last long at all. That's a good start. There we go. Now, let's hopefully get the last of the hide we need and we can head back. That got, that got us two hides. That guy gave us next to none, whereas the one before gave us most of what we needed, really. Right, so now what am I out of? Stone, easy fixed. All this free, easy to pick up stone around us. See who else we can come across. I finally got one of you. Two hides, not a lot, but it's the same as we got out of the last pterodactyl we hit. Those, my old friends. Ah, uh, and you. There we go, you finally got out of the rock, did you? Right, so there's four. Oh. Uh, 
the other dirt on two. There you are. And another, thank you for alerting me to your presence here. So, now we have all the hides we need. We're just not quite to the point of being able to level up, which is a pity. But I didn't actually expect to be able to level up in this episode yet anyway, so that's not a big issue. I'm going to increase... Oh, I can't increase your speed. Fine, let's increase your stamina. And what is this saying? I've got four points. It's not a worry at the moment. What I want is for you to come to the roof and I'll get you to stop on the roof so you don't keep flying into everything. I'm getting stuck. What one was after? I want the cooked fishies and the cooked meat. And then yeah, I can put out the fire because it's enough. Alright, so let's put all of this raw meat in here. Raw meat, raw meat. I'm out, am I? Hmm. Well, I'll just give you to one of my dinosaurs. Take this one too, please. I do not have a use for it, apparently. No, that's not what I wanted. You, in there. Alright, so. Let's head up to the roof. And pin our flying friend up here. Oh, it looks like he's a bit broken. But we do have enough leather to be able to make the saddle. We just need to be able to learn the saddle. So let's put all our leather away because I don't want to use it before the saddle. And drop you. I don't need that many, so let's just take a few. No, this isn't too bad. Alright, so I'm going to basically just go off and farm until I reach the next level and see whether or not it's going to be enough to increase well whether or not it's going to be enough to be able to learn how to make the new saddle that we're after so I'll catch you guys after I reach level up going to do? I was going to increase my weight component and now we need well looks like we might be waiting for the next level up before we can do that but I'm expecting saddles all take a fair amount of 
points. So I'm not going to spend these points. I'm going to wait till I level up next and we're going to get our lovely friend's saddle first. And then we will finally be able to fly and then we can look at what we want to learn with any points left over. But for now, I'm all out of time. So I'll see you guys in the next one where hopefully we will reach a point where we can build the saddle for our flying friend who has managed to glitch himself into wool and now is just motionless on the beach. But we'll work on getting the saddle for her, I believe it was. But that will be next time. So until then, have fun!